Hey, how's it, Laker Nation? This is the foundation with the Lakers season preview. Yes, I know I'm a little late, but the Lakers season hasn't started just yet. <laughs> but it's going to be exciting, but a little bit of mixed emotions. If you haven't heard, Paul Allen, the, the Trailblazers slash Seahawks owner, passed away. So, you know, while it's going to be exciting, you know, you know, guy that did a lot of things for Seahawks. You know, my uncle lives in Seattle, so there's a lot of, you know, he kept, he kept Seattle in C, you know Seahawks in Seattle, um, he does he does he's done some good things with the uh, Trailblazers as well too, so that it's a big loss for for a couple fan bases and for the league for that matter, um, you know if you're just a fan of sports you know and all that, um, I wasn't gonna do this but I figure I gotta touch a little bit more on it because it it happened after the fact and all that, um, I said I I touched on it earlier. But, you know, a video that I made a little while back. But there's like a little civil war going on between the Laker fans. And it's gotten a little bit, you know, now it's kind of simmered down again. But at one time it was pretty high and all that. And, you know, there's one on each side, you know, the Kobe, the, the Kobe Bryant diehard supporters and the LeBron same supporters. I started off with the, Kobe, uh, the, the, the LeBron guys. <laughs> Now, I get it, you, you know, you love LeBron, you followed him wherever he went, you're loyal to him. That's that's fine, I, I have no problem with that. You're going to support the Lakers, that's fine. But unless you were a Laker, Laker fan, I better not hear, you know, I hope none of the Laker fans said it. But but for any fan out there that, that automatically has a nerve to say, oh, LeBron is going to be an all-time great Laker already, I'm like, yeah, who, what? How the hell he becomes a great all-time great Laker? What has he done for the Lakers? Yeah, what he done for the NBA and stuff like that. You want to call him a great time all-time NBA player? That's fine. I'm I'm not gonna argue with that. That is truth. That is facts. But to say that he's an all-time great Laker, what has he done for the Lakers? You know, he he hasn't bring sixteen championships to the team. You know, he has his own three championships, but that's with the Heat and the Cavaliers. They they'll stay with them, you know. They don't come to the Lakers. They don't add to nineteen, and LeBron doesn't in inherit sixteen championships. You know, it doesn't work that way. You know, but you know, and 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 until he does something, you know, he's just gonna. I mean, he's gonna be. He looks like a good, very good NBA uh, Laker right now. He's not. He's not gonna be great. He hasn't. Like I said, he hasn't done anything. So. So we're, I cannot judge that right now. And then for the Kobe Bryant fans out there, you know, and I hope none of them was the, the diehard Laker fans, you know, that, that supported Kobe Bryant, you know, to say that they wanted to see, they wanted to see the Lakers fail. I was like, I, I me being a Lakers fan, like, look, I'm wearing a, this a Laker jersey. There's no numbers, no nothing. And I cannot fathom saying that I, I want to see the Lakers fail just because I don't like a player you know for any team that I support there <laughs> you know like it, here's an example uh, Tio I hate I did not like I was not a fan of him I did not want him on the team nothing I was happy when he was gone but the moment but when he was signed on the on the Cowboys in 2007 when that looked like a, a promising year that that we would that would do something with that season. I was all, all I was supporting Tio as much as I could. I could I could care less. He was wearing the he was wearing the star and all that. You know, but <laughs> but the thing was is that like like I was not I was I was not going to say, man, I hope we don't win a championship because I don't want to have Tio. To say that, oh yeah, I, w I, w I was the guy, you know, I was one of the guys that brought the... Bro, I was like, hey, that was already 10 years plus already that we didn't win a Super Bowl. So, if I couldn't do that, then, you know, I like LeBron a little bit more than... I, I like LeBron more than I like Tio as a, as a fan. As a human being, I, I like Tio. I, I, I think Ter Terrell Owens is a great guy and all that. But, you know, the same thing goes for LeBron James. He's a great guy. But as far as being fans of them... As far as players, you know, I wasn't the big, you know, I damn well wasn't a fan of, of Tio. I respected his game, but I just did not like him. 
and and as um and LeBron James. You know, I respected his game too. I wasn't a big fan of him though. Um, so that's why I cannot fathom saying that I want to see the Lakers fail. You know, as long as as long as LeBron James wears this jersey, bruh, I hope he brings us a championship. Bruh. I'm, you know. You know, like I, I, I'm so optimistic that you know that that there's some excitement again to the to the Lakers and all that. So, you know, but yeah, that that is that already. Um, and and really quick too, you know, like there is no way that that LeBron can, you know, even winning one championship, there's no way still yet. You know, I'm, I'm gonna be appreciative if he wins, but there's no way you can convince me that he's better, that he's greater Laker than just because he wins one championship. No, he's the guy that helped bring back the championship to the Lakers. And that's that's greatly to be appreciated and admired for. You know, but, you know, that that kinds of stuff, leave it alone. Those, those all-time great stuff, because it's so subjective as well. Um, now, moving on to the season. <laughs> uh, I love, you know, Brandon Ingram. I am a huge fan of Brandon Ingram. And he looks like the guy right now to say, hey, LeBron. I'm your running mate, back. you know. I can I can ride along with you, uh, you know. Just give me the chance, you know. He's he's improved his game, you know. He's a def excellent defender. He can run the point, you know. He can do a lot of good things. So, so you know he, you know, I believe that he can help LeBron be that other, be the other guy, you know, to to take over some things and all that. Kyle Kuzma, for the example, too. He's a, he seems like he's you know he's improved. He worked on in his game. Lonzo. You know he looks a little thicker. He worked on his looked like he worked on his release and everything like that. So, you know, and and he's an unselfish player, to, you know, um, by default and all that. So, but hopefully he he can bring up a little, little more aggression when he gets into the lane and stuff like that. You know, bring up you know work on his inside game. Josh Hart, I love this. You know, I that's another kid I really a big fan of. Uh, he was up and down. You know, I, I I he drove me crazy in the beginning of the season. You know, but then he won. I mean, he, he won me over by the end of the season because he he just started like showing no fear, kept on kept on bringing it, being that that real tough guy like Derek Fisher, like you know, like I said, pit bull. And then even in the summer league, he he showed a little bit more. Um, uh, so V, I'm really excited to see Savi because he he could be a marksman for for this team and all that. Um, I know we brought in the Rondos and and McGee, um, Stevens and Beasley and all them. Um, you know, cut, cast the characters, but I hope we can, you know, they they can be a balance be, 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 uh, of this team. You know, because I don't want to see these guys get stunted just because we have these guys and all that. Um, don't be surprised you see a struggle in the beginning because. One thing I noticed in the preseason, there was a little bit too much past happy things going on. Like, hey, hey, like, hey, we, look at us. We can make extra passes. Mm -hmm. it, it sometimes is, it is too much. You know, sometimes it's too much. I, do I like the fact that we're unselfish with the ball? Hell yeah. But, <laughs> but I'm not gonna, you know. But make the right play. You know, Rondo is a great create uh, creator with his passing ability. James, you know, he can do that. Lonzo, you know, you know, he he's very good at that too. So, you know, make you know, these guys are giving you the ball for a reason. Shoot the ball, get the points, let's go. You know. Anyway, that's I got. Um I'm not gonna do probably do tons of videos, um, but I'll do as much as I can. It's a long season, eighty two games, it's hard to keep up with everything. Um I'm watching the games, but just making videos and all that. But anyway, Mahala for watching, Lake Nation, Aloha.